have been very, very clear from here about where we stand uh, when it comes to the debt ceiling. I have been clear, the president has been clear, it should not be used as a political football. The debt limit uh, should be dealt with uh, without conditions. We've been very, very clear on that. This should be done without conditions. And um, it, is, it is their basic job, Congress, right? It is their basic duty to lift the debt ceiling. It's pretty simple and it's pretty straightforward. Uh, we believe that Congress has a constitutional duty to get this done, to lift the debt ceiling. We've been saying that and they should do it without conditions. We've been very clear. We're not going to negotiate on the debt ceiling because this is something that is a constitutional duty uh, that uh, Congress has and they need to move forward and lift the debt ceiling. That is something that is not negotiable. He never came to the table to negotiate on the debt ceiling. That was not something that occurred. That is not something that's happening. We've been very clear. We're not negotiating around the debt ceiling. It is not us, it is them. The onus is on Congress to get this done. This is their constitutional duty. We should not have to negotiate on this. We should not be doing this with conditions. We've been very clear about that. We do not want to negotiate on this. We've been very clear. We're not going to negotiate over, uh, over avoiding default. We have said very clearly, they need to deal with what's at stake here, what's at hand, which is the our, the, our economy, which is uh, making sure that we do not default. And the president said he's happy to meet with McCarthy, but not on whether or not the debt limit gets extended. That's not negotiable. What I'm going to say is we've been very clear. It needs to be done without condition.